A school teacher took part in the hugely popular survival series in Quebec. She took time off work to do it, and now she's out of a job. Stéphane Giroux reports. Bienvenue à la deuxième saison de Survivor Québec! Yeah! The Quebec version of Survivor isn't that different from the original American one. Twenty local participants fight to be the last survivor on a tropical island by trying not to get booted off by fellow teammates. Deborah de Bricaire is holding her own during season two, but she happens to be a school teacher at this elementary school in Saint Hyacinthe, and she got fired for taking unauthorized time off. A shame, says her union. It sends the message, the message that. If you work as a teacher, forget about it for all whatever experience you may live during the school year. The union says De Bricaire did find a substitute teacher to cover her two-month leave, but the service center never approved her plan, so it fired the 39-year-old woman for insubordination. In Saint Hyacinthe, people are split. Yes, her job should have come first. But firing De Bricaire was a bit harsh, especially considering the show's visibility. She's a model to students, he says. If you want to pursue your dreams, you can achieve them, he adds. In fact, there's another teacher on the show. Gladys Bro works at the Collège de Montréal. The school not only kept her on staff, but is promoting her achievements among students. If I can say it, they use her as a model. But if one was turned into a model, the union leader says Deborah was made to be an example. School staff wouldn't comment on the situation and told us to leave. But the service center now says that Deborah, the survivor, is free to continue teaching, but as a substitute. Stéphane Giroux, CTV News, in Saint-Hyacinthe.